I'll show you how to make a video like this with a rotating mug with your design. To do this, I need Adobe Photoshop CS4 or higher and animated PSD mockup from the Mag Mockups bundle by Rebrandy. You will find it by the link in the description. This bundle contains a total of 36 mockups with 18 mug shapes and two viewing angles. With it, you can add your own design, change the handle and inner colors, and export animations directly from Photoshop. Get 36 animated mockups with 50% discount for just $15 using promo code MUG50. I'll leave a promo code in the description. If you want to try it for free you can register on rebrandy.net and download free glass mug animated mockup here. Check the link in the description. I'm using a mockup of 11 ounce mug. Open the timeline panel to work with this animated mockup. To insert the design I will open the smart object double click to open. Then I'll also click on the smart object with the same name. Let's change the mug's color using a color layer. Here I'll turn on the visibility of the shape folder so I can see the front and back of the mug. I simply drag the cute fox face image onto the front part. Then I drag and place the design for the back side. Turn off the visibility of the help folder and save. Also save the previous smart object. I move the slider on the timeline panel to see how the design looks on the mug from all angles. Let's change the color for the handle and the elements color folder to orange, like the body of the mug. In the same way, I will change the color of the inside of the mug using the inner color layer. Then I adjust the glossiness of the mug, I want to make it more glossy using the effects folder. The highlights layer is responsible for the highlights on the mug. And the shadows layer is for enhancing the dark areas. So, the mug is ready. Now I can customize the background. In the background folder, using the color layer, I'll change the color to beige. To make scene more realistic, I'll insert a background image of the marble table by simply dragging the image onto the Your Background Design Here layer. Let's move the mug lower so that it stands on the table. Then I will adjust the opacity of the falling shadow from the mug on the table. I move the slider in the timeline panel to see if the duration of the inserted background matches the length of the mug animation. Indeed, the duration does not correspond. I'll fix it now. Now the scene with the mug is ready. All that's left to do is export the animation. Go to the top panel. File. Export. Render video. Check the export settings and click render. Wait a bit. Let's see the exported animation. This is totally sick. Now I want to create a GIF animation. To do this, I import the video into Photoshop. I need to make the GIF smaller, so I'll resize the image first. Next, I'll resize the canvas so my GIF becomes square. Super duper! Now let's export the GIF. Go to the top menu, File, Export, Save for Web. I'll check the animation and save it. Let's see the result. Perfect. We did a good job. That's all I wanted to show you. All links to products and promo code are in the description. Thanks for watching. Have a great time.